Hi everyone, while playing Wukong, and after getting angry and frustrated with the final boss, I decided to level up to unlock all the personal advancement skills. After watching a few videos, I discovered that the most convenient area was Pool of Shattered Jade, and after getting the transformation I needed. Quest for me? It was hard to find it, but... You have... I started farming, and after going back and forth for 5 minutes, I said to myself, why don't we automate the process? I started looking for the language that seemed most suitable, and I found that C++ was the one that best suited my needs, thanks to its ability to simulate keys pressed not only alone, but also in combination with others, such as Shift plus W to run. Python is still valid, but for recent games like Wukong, the program could have caused problems. Now I had to figure out how to simulate the keys, and luckily for me, the Windows H library has Win32 API functions, which are exactly what we need to use since they control all inputs, keyboard and mouse. The strategy was now simple. I had divided each step the character had to take into 18 steps, 9 to go and explode the transformation to get the willpower points, and 9 to return and restore the area by resting in the sanctuary. But there was a small problem, the character was slow as fuck. For some reason, even though I was using the version of the program written in C++ and not Python, the game did not read the keys pressed in combination. I realized I had to redo everything. At that point, I opted to use the scan code command which, unlike the virtual key command, reads the hardware code generated when a key is pressed without emulating anything else. Now it's much better. But that's not all, because I had to set both the degrees of rotation of the view, and how far the character could run forward. So I decided to make the program parametric by implementing a configuration file where I could decide which commands to include. In my case, I only needed forward running, view rotation, and pressing the key to transform. And after hours spent deciding how much to rotate the view and how much to move the character forward, it literally took me two hours, I succeeded. This is how it works. It seems slow, but in 40 seconds you earn 2,700 will, which means that in an hour you earn 243,000 will, all without even touching a key on the keyboard or mouse. For today's video is everything, you can find the program in the link in the description, along with the .cpp file and the configuration file. Remember to subscribe, leave a like, and comment if you want a program that works in any game and emulates all keyboard commands. See you in the next video.